Hi, this is Scott Kilos here, 6 Delta Alpha Yankee, and for today's video we're back with another installment in our Yesu VX6 Operator Series. And for today's video what we're going to be talking about is accessing the special memory channels in your radio. What the special memory channels are is three different sets of memory channels um, relating to different radio services that are pre-programmed into your radio from the factory. Uh, and regardless of how many times you reset this radio or whatever you program this radio to do, these channels will always stay available within your radio. Uh, and what we're talking about here is in terms of the three different sets of uh, memory channels. Uh, first off you have your weather channels. You have all ten of your weather channels that are programmed in there. Then it's got marine, uh, VHF marine channels and there's 280 of those programmed in. And then lastly you have 89 shortwave channels that are frequencies that are programmed into the radio that you can monitor. So let me show you how to get to those and I'll show you what it looks like. So to access the special memory channels you need to go to the special bank. Now so what you're going to do is you're going to short press the FW key and short press the SPBNK which is special bank key. So we short press FW, press 9 and you saw WXCHN come up that's our weather channels and using the, uh, the channel control knob here of course we see our 10 available weather channels that are on there. Now if I want to go to the next set of available channels all I'm going to do is just short press the band key and that brings up marine and this is our 280 VHF marine channels that you can scan through and of course these just like the weather channels are organized uh, in frequency mode. Now another short press takes you to radio and what this is is shortwave. So starting off at channel one we have Voice of America and the first four channels in this are going to be VOA which is US based shortwave. Then we move on channel five to Voice of Canada and so on and so forth. Now it mentions in the manual that you can go into the menu and switch from name to frequency mode and look at the actual frequencies relevant to this. If you do this, one would think it would do it for all of the channels that you're going to scroll through, but no, it's only going to do it for the one channel you're looking for or looking at. And the second you turn that knob, it switches right back to VOA or, or whatever section you're on. And uh, you have to do that each and every time. It's almost easier if you're going to be doing this a lot to just keep your manual handy. And on page 43 of the manual, there's a full listing of the shortwave channels uh, by frequency, their channel number, which is the channel number in, uh, in this programming scheme, and then the tag, so in this case VOA, and what that means, Voice of America. Um, now, in terms of the performance of this radio and shortwave with the factory antenna, I'm going to be talking about that in a subsequent video, specifically about how to improve your shortwave experience with this radio. But the, it's kind of a nice touch. It gives you a, a decent number of extra channels on there that you don't have to go in and program yourself. And some of them, of course, very, very useful. If uh, weather channel is always useful, the uh, marine radio is great if you're in a maritime environment. Although chances are you probably have a, a marine radio already set up for that specific purpose. But if you're traveling to those areas, it's a, it's a nice little touch. I use this uh, when I visit the Central California coast and listen into some stuff over in Morro Bay. And I've had pretty good results with the uh, SRH3 uh, 320 Alpha antenna on here. Now to, and then of course uh, with shortwave, like I said, subsequent video we'll talk about uh, ways to improve that because there's some work that needs to be done. But to exit out of this mode, there's two ways of doing this. Uh, the first, of course, is going to be to just press the VM key, but you, it requires one extra step. I'll show you an easier way in just a second. So if you press the VM key, it's going to take you to VFO, and one more press is going to take you back to memory mode. Going back here again, uh, the quickest way out of this, to be honest with you, is the way you got in. Press the FW and 9 key, and it takes you right back to where you were before. So that's kind of it. Um, uh, special banks can, can be kind of interesting, something for you to play with and uh, experiment. And for some people, they might not even know that some of this stuff is even on their radio. So with that, I will bring it to a close. Thank you for watching and or listening. This is Scott, Kilo Sierra 6, Delta Alpha Yankee from Visalia, California. Have a wonderful day.